Welcome back to Veertech Gaming. Now that we have the economy store set up out of the way, let's take a look at how we can regulate how much and how often your players can gain more in their banks and wallets, ultimately giving them more spending powers in your store. First, we're going to give you an overview on what's to come in the next few episodes from Veertech and the tutorials. Today, we're going to be starting with admin controls, customizing your currency, setting a player's starting balance, how to add to player's balance, removing a player's balance, wiping your player's balances for wipe or setting them back to the value of your choice. Once that's complete, we'll have a look into rewards, setting PVP rewards, rates, looking at the randomizer and also steal features, setting PVE rewards, again, rates and the randomizer again, and setting Discord event rewards. Then finally, gambling, setting up the big wheel, payout multipliers and cooldowns, setting up blackjack, payout multipliers and cooldowns. There's quite a bit. So since we got a lot to go through, let's get into it. Today we're starting with admin controls and customizing your currency. I have here, as you can see, an image which I wish to use for my currency. For clarity, these all fall within Discord's recommendations of size 128 by 128, and this is a PNG image, so we don't have a background. To get this upload ready for use, we simply have to head over to our server, select server settings, then the emoji tab, and finally click the upload emoji button, and you'll see here, once uploaded, it will auto apply to your emoji pool on your server. Take note of the emoji name. For me, it's currency one. So to check it on our discord, please use the double colon and type the start of your emoji and you'll see it appear. Now, to get this onto your currency, we need to use the command slash eco currency. And you will see here, it prompts us to enter a name. You now have the option to use just the emoji or just a word like coins, maybe, or even both. So I'm going to call mine VT coins, but I'm also going to use this image I created just for these purposes. Hit enter, and there you have it. Your very own customized currency ready for you and your community. Now let's take a look into setting starting balances. This balance is automatically applied when people successfully link using the slash link command. To set this, we simply need to use the command slash echo start bal. And here we are prompted to enter a value into our command. I'm going to go ahead and give all my players 500 VT coins on linking. So I'm going to enter here 500, and now you will see this confirmation. Players linking for the first time will now receive the following amount, followed by our currency we created a moment ago. Performing a giveaway, competition in a game, or even just feeling generous, we got you covered. By using the command slash echo give, you can see that we can now give individual players a value of coins. Type gives us the option of wallet and bank. We can only purchase and gamble from our wallets. The bank is safe. Players can draw from this to their wallets if they so choose. And finally, players, we can type the player's Discord names here that correlate to their in-game name for payments. This text box also supports roles. So I'm going to be giving 500 VT coins, but to all my VIPs all at once. We can do this by typing at VIP and you'll see here is my VIP role. Hitting enter, the text box will indicate how many players it gave that value to. Mine says zero as this is only a testing server and we sadly have no VIPs linked. We can also perform a negative command. Maybe this is for punishment, entry fees, and even fines. This time, using the command slash echo take, again we have all the same parameters, amount, type, and name, or role, and again we can use all the same as before. But instead, as it says in the command, it takes the value from them. Now, let's say you've performed a wipe. Maybe you've agreed that everyone should get a wallet wipe following the server wipe. To do this, we need to use the command slash echo set val. Keep in mind that we may need to do this twice, once for bank and once for wallet. Very similar to the give and take commands, we can enter a value. I'm setting mine at zero. Choose the type. For now, let's just do wallet and players. Here, I'm going to use the at everyone tag and there is no one without this role. Hit enter and you'll see that it has set the wallet balance for the number of players it mentions. Again, you will need to repeat this for the bank values to also set them back. And there you have it, a great way to get started with your admin controls on the economy system. We covered customizing your currency, setting a player's starting balance upon linking, how to add to a player's balance, take away from a player's balance, and finally, wiping your player's balances for wipe or setting them back to a value of your choice for that all important wipe day. Join us next time where we will dive into the setting the rewards for PvP, PvE, and finally Discord events. Until then, happy grubbin'.